Okay, so in this episode of Gab Details, we're going to be trying out the professional wheel cleaning foam from Auto Fanatic. Uh, as you can see, I have an F type one gallon bottle here with the wide mouth. Uh, I have it labeled. We're going to be doing six to one. Uh, we do have distilled water filled up to about here. So that is not an entire gallon. As you can see, the gallon of water is still full up to here. So we're going to put six ounces of the wheel cleaning foam in this bottle here give it a shake and then we're going to put it in the ik foam 9 sprayer the uh, feeder tube that we have here is the orange tip uh, per auto fanatics instructions for uh, best results i will link uh, multiple videos in the description for uh, everything you need to know about this uh, product safe for ceramic coatings sealants and wax protectants this product is formulated to be applied with a professional applicator to increase dwell time and effectiveness of cleaning action conventional spraying is not suggested so uh, step one is going to be to pre-rinse uh, the, the wheels and step two mix your desired ratio which we're going to do now apply even foam to all surfaces including the wheel barrel recommended dwell time is two to four minutes foam two wheels at a time for greater efficiency heavily soiled wheels may need to be lightly agitated now the barrel of the wheel on my truck is um kind of machined like corduroy pants i guess you'd call it so i actually use an easy detail brush in order to uh, agitate that. Uh, in Auto Fanatics videos, you'll see him using a wheel woolly, which I do have. Um, I actually use them on the wheels for the Camaro. Uh, we're going to be trying it out in the summertime on those wheels because they're freshly powder coated, matte centers, and gloss lips. So we're gonna be trying to go for a full touchless wheel cleaning, which is one of the benefits to using the professional wheel cleaning foam. So this will be the pre-rinse. Okay, so if you haven't used your GoPro in a week and it still says that you have 61% battery, don't believe the camera because the battery just died. So I'd say that we're probably got the product dwelling for about two minutes. Now, uh, I do have a little bit of protection on the wheels. Uh, I used um, wheel wax prior to the winter. Um, the truck has seen some heavy duty uh, weather lately. Uh, the truck was cleaned last month with a regular two bucket wash and then I put some CarPro Reload on the face of the wheels but you can see that inside the barrel there is a significant amount of brake dust and dirt being released. You can see it in the foam on the ground here and then even working off of 
the tire so while the truck was washed a month ago um, it has seen its fair share of salt so it has been uh, only rinsed at an automatic wash um, I have those pictures on my Instagram if you'd like to see how well a ceramic coating uh, keeps up your vehicle during the winter months so I'm gonna let this dwell for 30 to 60 more seconds and then I'll rinse it off bucket of water here I just used the brush here to agitate the uh, lug nut pockets so we're going to now go ahead and give it a rinse We did go ahead and add the uh, Mosmatic Wand from Obsessed Garage for our swiveling SGS28 pressure gun. So, we right the face of the wheels. You can see here, my hand is clean inside the barrel. And my hand is clean. So, Unfortunately, we do have embedded brake here. That's winter in the Midwest, but uh, you know, looking to get the wheels redone in the springtime. But again, hands clean, uh, zero agitation uh, on the face of the wheel or in the barrel whatsoever, um, and even the tires. Uh, so, if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you like the Auto Fanatic Professional Wheel Cleaning Foam, or if you've been using it yourself, give the video a thumbs up. And for more detailing videos, please hit the subscribe button. Thanks. Here's a little bonus footage uh, on the driver's side front wheel. I did not pre-rinse anything, so I have a before picture of that. And you can already see here the foam uh, releasing all the brake dirt and dust. You can see on the inside of the barrel there. So this product is as advertised. So um, let's make sure Auto Fanatic knows that we appreciate all of his hard work and time spent on uh, you know formulating and coming up with such a great product.